everybody. Oh my goodness. I did not want to go to the gym this morning, but I feel good that I did. Just took a full shower. I am still recovering from my weekend in Nashville with my college girlfriends. Holy moly, there is so much on the to-do list today. It's going to be a very productive vlog today because, listen, like, I've got two things checked off and there's still a lot to do, but I just opened this cute PR package from Liquid IV. Love them. Threw on their sweatshirt. I have a new uh, Hydration Plus Immune Support. Haven't tried it. Can't tell you how good it is. They did send me, like, a cute little package. I do know I have a code. I think it's Gracie O'Connor or Gracie O'Connor 25. This isn't sponsored by them, but you know, always love to give it a little love to brands that send me things. So thank you, Liquid IV. Love you guys. And now I'm just gonna go grab a Celsius. I just have a ton to do, including unpacking from Nashville, repacking for Brady's because I'm gonna stay there for the next two nights. But also I'm going on a daddy-daughter date tonight, which we haven't done in so long, but I'm going to the Panthers game with my dad. And I'm so excited because just nice to spend time with him like that. And then on top of that, what else do we have to do? Potentially finishing up a video and a thumbnail and having it go live today. I can't even remember what all is on the to-do list. I need to call Delta about something. Like, there's just a lot of random miscellaneous things, but also YouTube stuff that I've got to get going. Also, because I got back from Nashville, luckily I cleaned my sheets before I left. I have to make my bed and clean up and things like that. Wow, my hair looks like a mess. I'm talking fast. It's the morning and I haven't even had my caffeine, but I'm gonna get my my room kind of put together because it is absolutely a mess. Happy Tuesday! I have no idea where my tripod is, so you're resting on top of my care of vitamin box right now. But obviously, I just brushed my hair. I just have not been sleeping well recently. Don't know what it is. Like, obviously, in Nashville, girls' trip, we were busy, we were sleeping on a pull out couch. Still, like, even last night, I just could not get my mind to stop racing. It was so annoying because I was so tired, and all I wanted to do. Ooh, Let's go to bed. So I'm pulling out my little patches this morning to help with my under eyes because I need some of this. These are on Amazon. I think I have them linked under like my skincare and bathroom essentials. Um, storefront list. I always have my storefront in the description of my videos now because you'll always ask where things are from and like I'm just not very good about linking things a lot of the time but like they are on my storefront. So now my storefront is like permanently linked in the description box down below so y'all can shop those kinds of things on there here's what i'm gonna be looking like but i'm gonna try and conquer my bed first make my bed make it all pretty so then i can start unpacking and repacking <laughs> I started packing like just for everything that I need today in the next couple of days But then I decided I was hungry not the healthiest thing in the world But made a bowl of cereal and I dumped in way too much milk But like I already had a ton of cereal in there. So whatever I brought my laptop over here to check on the video and the video editing stuff and making a thumbnail this week I think my video schedule is gonna be Tuesday Thursday or at least I'm hoping so So I'm gonna make the thumbnail and we're just gonna sit here and do some work. It's 1121 I have to leave in an hour and 40 minutes for an appointment and then I go off to see Charlie and then I go off to the hockey game So everything that needs to be done in this house needs to be done in the next hour and 40 minutes And I'm a little nervous breakfast is finished my video is uploading and I've got a thumbnail done So I'm feeling very productive. It is 11:48, So now I only have an hour and 12 minutes until I need to be leaving here and I realized I've got maybe a couple more things to do. I am so stressed, but I'm trying not to really even think about it. So we're gonna get on with packing for Brady's and seeing what else I need to check off the to-do list that has to be done before I leave here today. Okay, so I have crossed quite a few things off the to-do list. Next, I'm gonna pack for Brady's. I don't really need to bring too much over there, just obviously some clothes and stuff. This is the stuff I'm gonna be wearing to the Panthers game. I'm not gonna wear it all day. So just gotta pack some things in here some of those things and then I can cross that off to the to-do list. I do have to text somebody, so I'm gonna do that next. And I need to call Delta about something, so maybe I will try and call Delta while I'm packing. <music> so much better now that my hair is dry I still need to put on some makeup but I wanted to tell you guys about this magic molecule my high school friend Mackenzie and like her friends actually started this company and it is so cool I've been using it and I wanted to use it for a little bit before I started to talk to you guys about it I don't have a code I don't have anything I actually don't think it has released yet but keep your eyes out for magic molecule look at everything it does okay amazing for skin texture banish a breakout hydration through the sunburn eczema, psoriasis, bug bite, itchiness. I've been just using this on my face 
everything it feels oh so amazing it doesn't really have a smell to it but that's like not a good or a bad thing it just kind of smells like normal i don't know how to really describe it it's not perfumey or anything and it's so good for you and it's been so good for my skin so i'm just very proud of her and wanted to mention that again i don't know if it's out yet magic molecule i know that literally my bottle says early release it's a lab sample but keep your eyes out because it's going to change the game and it can do literally a million and one things so now that my hair is done i'm just going to finish packing up for brady's i should be getting a call back from delta any minute it was like an 18 minute wait and so i clicked call back i'm trying to convince somebody from one of my semester c friends to do a fun trip with me in january so that's what i'm doing right now i'm like texting I'm like come on guys this is a once in a lifetime trip um just because i was having an existential crisis when i couldn't fall asleep last night that i had to do something in my life so i don't really want to do it alone <laughs> necessarily anyway i am going to now just pack because i literally haven't done that yet it's been the same stuff that's been laying out i don't ever know what i want to wear i've got workout sets at his house but i think i'm just gonna pack like running shorts and t-shirts just because I'm gonna be chilling. I know it was just in Nashville this weekend and then it was like 30 degrees, but here it is still 80 degrees outside. Alexa, what's the temperature outside right now? Right now, it's 84 degrees Fahrenheit. By the way, Melissa McCarthy can now tell you the weather. You didn't just hear that, she says 84 degrees outside. So unfortunately I cannot wear this cute liquid IV jacket. I'm gonna have to change. Okay, so I'm all packed up, ready to go. My Celsius is done. You guys, we have the mobile groomer outside right now. And she just brought back in Dexter and took Nilla and Dexter. Look at you, handsome boy. You have to see him. Look at you, handsome boy. Did you just get a haircut and a bath? He looks so good. He's got his little lion's tail. And he smells so good. He's just so happy. Yeah, good boy. Anyway, I'm gonna get the rest of my things in the car for tonight, for babysitting, for Brady's, all of that. And then I'm gonna get on my way to my wax and then to Charlie and hopefully I have time to pick up lunch in between those two things. I didn't really plan well because they called this morning and had to reschedule me. So here's to hoping for that. Actually, I'm gonna fill up my Stanley and then we're gonna get out the door and on the way. Also, my outfit that I'm wearing today is an Align tank with these little like sweat shorts from Adidas. Um, I thought I was gonna be filming a reel, and then I just ran out of time. So if you see me in a reel in this, mind your business. Okay, so I just had my appointment, and I picked up some bole for lunch. I'm so excited because I haven't had bole in so long, and the guy really stocked up my bowl, so I appreciate them. And I got some cookies. I got one for Sarah, because she loves these too. Sarah is Charlie's mom. But I've been meaning to talk to you guys, because I have been driving a lot recently, from driving up to Orlando, back to Orlando. I'm in the car at least 50 minutes each way to Brady, so I'm in the car a lot these days, and I started re-listening to audiobooks. I really loved reading, but I've fallen out of reading a little bit, but I love the stories and different things that come with it. So I actually got a subscription to Audible and I have been loving it. I really want to listen to It Starts With Us, the new Colleen Hoover book, but I haven't listened to that one quite yet. But I know with my Audible credits, that is the absolute next one that I'm going to get. If you guys don't know, Audible is a subscription service to audiobooks. They've also got podcasts. They have so many different original audiobooks on there too. I used to have Audible a while ago and then I stopped listening to audiobooks and I'm like, why did I ever stop doing that, especially with Audible? And they have so many new sections and different things like podcasts that are included on there. I'm so glad I decided to re-download it. It just basically has all of your audio entertainment on one app, which is so nice. And every month you get one credit to get a new book. It could be fiction, non-fiction. They have thrillers, mysteries, so many different options to choose from. And they actually gave me a link and a code for you guys. So if you guys want to be like me and let Audible help you laugh, be inspired, be entertained, you actually, as a new member, can get your first 30 days for free. You can do that by going to audible.com slash Gracie or text Gracie to 500 500. There are so many titles and different things to choose from. I can't wait to hear what you guys pick. I'm going to get on to driving to the babysitting and I'm going to listen to my audiobook. I literally ate so much of my bowl driving but like I said he stocked up my bowl and I could not finish it all. And I'm going to bring in the two cookies because I finally got to John and Sarah's house. By the way I feel like I need to make this a point of clarification in case it's not Sarah. This is not my sister Sarah. Sarah, Sarah, this is my Uncle John's wife, Sarah. So my sister, none of my, there are no babies in the O'Connor Gould extended family. We do not have any of those right now. Um, so Charlie is kind of like 
my little nephew, I call him. Like he calls me, they call me Auntie Gracie. So it's, it's a little complicated, it's a little different, but it is not my sister. Anyway, I'm going to head inside and go see them, go see the baby, and maybe we'll get a little footage of Charlie. I can't wait to see him, it's been, oh gosh. It's been almost a week since I've seen him. I know that he's grown, he's now three months old. I just, I can't handle the cuteness. So we're gonna get over into there, I'm leaving my camera and stuff in the car. So if I do any footage, it'll be on my phone while he's sleeping, because obviously he's number one priority. So I'm gonna bring my water, the cookies, and we're gonna go. Okay, so I obviously have left John and Sarah's. I have met up with my dad at a Starbucks and he's gonna drive us to the rest of the way to the Panthers game. So I'm gonna grab some stuff and get in this car and I'm gonna start, I think, vlogging on my phone. Maybe I'll bring this camera I'll leave me in this car. But I'm gonna see him. We just got to the Florida Arena, BB&T Center, whatever you wanna call it. We're here with John and Sarah and Charlie. Yeah, my Let's go Panthers! I don't know. Did you bring your oh, jersey? And my dad's here getting his jersey. Yeah, baby, let's go Panthers, roll time. Yeah. And now we're gonna vlog on my phone because I don't want to get my t camera taken away. So, we'll see ya. It's always on the move. I know. It I was, love it. Well, me too. That was so fun. And I like winning. So it was a double fun for me. Yes. What a fun day. I'm currently at Brady's editing this. I'm actually vlogging today too. So make sure that you subscribe down below so you don't miss another video from me. I had so much fun on this little day. The Panthers game, being able to see Charlie, and seriously getting every single thing crossed off my to-do list. Can you even believe it? Okay, maybe one thing I didn't film the reel, but I ended up filming it the next morning. But I was feeling so accomplished and so proud of myself that you can do anything that you put your mind to. Anyway, I love you guys so much. Don't forget to follow along on other social media so that you can stay up to date with everything I'm doing. I love you, love you, love you, and I'll see you soon. Bye. Bye.